Now at 5.30, a possible solution after a 90-year-old Sarasota widow feared she would lose her home to an extensive list of code violations. Good evening, everyone. I'm Jamison Euler. And I'm Laura Harris. Marie Louise Sikorsky is facing thousands of dollars in fines after letting her home fall into disrepair. Hundreds of you reached out on Facebook. Others called the city. But new tonight, as ABC Action News reporter Lauren Rosella learned, the city now has a plan to help. So many of you guys reached out to us on social media concerned about the fines against Mrs. Sikorsky and code violations, worried and concerned that she was going to lose her home. Well, today we have an update and some good news for this homeowner. Signs pleading for help are coming down. Miles, a neighbor helping 90-year-old Marie Louise Sikorsky repair her unsafe home, says the city of Sarasota is offering solutions. He said, we're going to get this resolved really quickly. We have contractors coming over. Miles says Mrs. Sikorsky recently moved back to this home after being threatened with eviction in her mobile home. But because the home had been vacant, it had fallen into disrepair and was unsafe, including a pool with standing water and possible termite damage. Miles tried to do some of the repairs himself and brought in other handymen, some who may not have been licensed. Now the city has found some to make sure the home is safe. We do have some volunteers who are licensed contractors willing to go in and inspect the work and complete any work that remains to be done. The city says they've been working with Mrs. Sikorsky for more than two years. Now they're working to connect her with an advocate. Uh, we are looking for an independent elder care representative to be sure that she is totally uh, aware of everything going on around her. Miles is just glad someone will be taking care of Mrs. Sikorsky and that the city is coming to inspect the home so she's safe. Once that happens, the city says her fines should disappear. He said we're all going to learn something from this and so I think it can be a positive situation. Mrs. Sikorsky has another formal meeting with the city scheduled toward the end of this month. However, the city tells me they hope to have this taken care of far before that. In Sarasota, I'm Lauren Rosella, ABC Action News.